Well, hello. Hello, welcome back. Today, doing it again, Christopher is turning me into something. Last time, I turned Christopher into somebody. Click here. It's really fun and funny, but now it's Christopher's turn. He's so good at this. Uh-huh, and she's a liar. <laughs> so anyway, uh... Well, I've primed and prepped my face to give you the best possible outcome. I've set out all of the makeup and face paint that I have to give you a fighting chance. I know you're gonna do so a good. fighting chance. And I, look, look at me. I really, really, really want you to actually try and not give up halfway through this. We'll see about that. Okay, so this is gonna be something of a surprise Bye. because I don't know how to use any of this stuff. Well, you can ask me about any of these things. Okay, that's gonna have to happen. I don't know what any of those are. You're telling me that you can't d deduct what lip gloss and eyeliner are used for? Correct. <laughs> So he's grabbing, <laughs> he's grabbing one of my old beauty blenders. Whatever this is. Dipping into this green face paint, huh? Uh-huh. I don't know what I'm doing. But we're doing our best. I sound like Bob Ross. Happy little accident. I don't feel very good. Do I look green to you? <laughs> don't worry, baby. It's just a little jaundice. <laughs> You can also use this if you think it'll help you get the color on. You can use that if that makes it better. Oh, that does make it better. Thank you. If it's looking a little streaky, also it helps to do X motions over and over again. That is very effective. You know Shrek isn't Disney, right? Why are there no why are there no planes where Peter Pan lives? Because they can never land. Come yeah. on. That was easy. What did Snow White say when her photos weren't ready? I don't know. One day my prince will come. P-R-I-N-T-S. Oh my god. <laughs> why did Mickey Mouse get hit with a snowball? Because Donald ducked. <laughs> this is nice. <laughs> Let's see, you enjoy that? You're like, you look like you were. It feels relaxing. Unlike you, who thinks it's assaulting. It is awful. This is serious. So how do I... Are you done with the green? Yes. This is Macron Paradise paint. I use the white one on Christopher's face. I'm scared. Yeah, I would be too. Ah, darling, maybe you've heard of it. Stop <laughs> sorry. laughing. You're ruining my masterpiece. I was gonna tell the story about how you almost had to propose to me at Epcot. Bruh, like, what a travesty. So we were at Disney World last year, and Christopher proposed to me at Be Our Guest restaurant. I'll put a photo up. It was at Be Our Guest restaurant on our last day, and on our last day, what we did was we did a half day at Epcot and a half day at Magic Kingdom. And unbeknownst to me, the whole time we were there, Christopher had the ring because we didn't go back to the hotel to change. We just changed in the bathroom. So we were leaving Epcot to get a bus to Magic Kingdom. Unbeknownst to us, yeah. you have to take the monorail from Epcot to the kingdom. So we went into Epcot the first time, to actually the first time we entered the park. The security person checked our Christopher's bag so I didn't have a bag and then we went through and then later on in the day we exited the park and then realized we had to take the monorail to Magic Kingdom and the monorail is inside the park so we had to go inside the park and for whatever reason something had happened this time I guess but they were like prison checking our bags this time taking everything out so bag check got all like soupy croopy weird and I had the ring in my backpack in a sock. So, I mean, it was like super in there. Like I was trying to keep it away from Jordan because she's kind of nosy. And they're going through my bag and whatnot. And they're going through every single bit of thing they can find. And she gets to the sock and rolled up in it is the box with the ring in it. And Jordan was away the whole time they were checking my bag. She was off in the corner making faces at me, taking my picture, you know, typical girlfriend stuff. Because I didn't have a bag, I could, I could go through the no bag yeah. line. So I'm sitting there doing everything I can to like go, okay, cool, once we get to the sock, I'll tell her she'll see it. 
Well, Jordan decides at that time, right when we get to the sock, she's gonna walk up. As Jordan is next to me, and the security guard is going through our bag, literally just found the sock with the ring in it, <laughs> Jordan walks up, and as she's walking up, I turn in front of the guard, and I start murmuring out of my mouth, it's a ring, it's a ring, I'm getting engaged, it's a ring, quiet, stop, put it down. And she drops it and puts it back in the bag. MVP of the year right there. Yeah. Jordan had no idea, she thankfully. It. I had no clue. I wasn't paying attention at all. Dude, I was freaking out, bro. I was losing You did a good job covering up. Yeah, that was like so nerve-wracking. I was like, man, if I have to propose right here, so be it. I want to propose at Epcot. And that was the story about how Christopher almost proposed to me at Epcot. How's it look? Very scary. <laughs> You're doing a good job. Thanks. So if nobody's guessed so far what I'm doing, I'm sure you know by now. I need to get around your eyes more with the green. Right here. Yeah. At the place where I work, a customer saw me at Disney World. He was also at Disney World at the same time. I had a stitch in my backpack. Same day that we were almost got caught. Same day? Caught. What an eventful same, day. Yeah, what an eventful day. But I get back to Texas and I'm at work and he goes, Man, I think I saw you at Disney World. And I was like, no kidding. He goes, yeah, you had a stitch in your backpack. And I was like, yeah, that was definitely me. Because <laughs> I walked around with stitch in my backpack for almost all of that because I really wanted to stitch one. So, stitch Yeah, plus. we couldn't. It was our last day, so we couldn't send it to the, to the hotel room. Yeah. It was now or never, as they like to say. Okay, your cheeks a little more. That stitch is on the shelf behind me right now. Okay. He's right there. <laughs> Okay, let me see what are some more key traits of, of this character. No, I, I don't know. You could do some shading here to make his smile look better if you want to. Like his eyebrow right shadow right there. And then I get this stuff, right? Yeah. The green. The dark green. As you can tell, we're ready for Halloween. I got it. The I mean, this is supposed to be yours, so you can do whatever you want. But your advice would be greatly appreciated. But, okay, now don't do too much. What do I do? Shade, make it look like, like when you raise your eyebrows, you have eyebrow wrinkles. So you just do do that around, around here. Like poof it right there? See, this is where the path starts to <laughs> And this is where we have problems now. <laughs> I just blend it a little bit. <laughs> no! Don't put my eyeshadow brush into the dirty paint water. That's, that looks pretty good. I like that. I mean, it could obviously be better, but for an amateur, like I would my, take it up over this part of the eye too. And then do eye. it here also. On the cheeks. That has happened to me before, seeing somebody that you know at Disney World. Happened to David <laughs> all the time, apparently. Yeah, he knew everybody. <laughs> He turned, every time I turned around, David would be like, Hey! And I was like, how do you keep running into everybody here? <laughs> the first trip I ever went to Disney World, we were in, it was downtown Disney at the time. And there was a girl that I was actually went to school with. Where else you want to put the shape? Oh, right here. I thought like you meant right like, here. like, right here. Like when you smile, you have these lines right here. Sure. Um, yeah, I ran into a girl, her name was Lauren Thompson that I went to school with at Downtown Disney, we took a picture together. Yeah, that, I got from here, that eyebrow shading looks very nice. Your eyes are green too, so it like, looks super wicked from my angle anyway. You probably won't be able to pick that up on the camera, but I like it. Everything <laughs> looks blurry to me. Everything looks blurry. You've got paint in my eye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like bad salts, but paint in the eye. Oh my God, <laughs> this is a, Family, wholesome family channel. We can't talk about drugs. Those aren't drugs. Bath salts? <laughs> <laughs> the only could... thing that bothers Christopher is a wig with no head in it. Because that's disturbing. <laughs> Wigs in general are disturbing. I'm not a fan. Okay. It looks like I'm already doing that. This is kind of shiny. Yeah. I would put black eyeshadow on that to make it not shiny. Close your eyes. That does look a lot better now that you've mentioned it. See, this is why you're here. You're the pro. Uh -huh. I kind of feel like we cheated because I helped you. Yeah, but like, we need the score going into this, <laughs> how this would be. I'm not gonna lie, you've done a pretty 
pretty good job. I can't, I mean, I'm far away, so I can't tell really. I think it looks pretty good. Why are you looking? You can just look at it on me, not at the camera. Well, it looks better in the video. <laughs> <laughs> it looks better on camera. It looks better on camera than it does in person. I mean, in person, it still looks pretty good. The shadowing is really awful. But I think the, the, the paint and stuff looks pretty good. I could probably, like, if you open your, your eyes open, I could get more paint around your eyes. What I would do before you start is clean this off and then take the green and lightly outline around the eyes just to kind of make sure that the shadow isn't touching onto the, <laughs> onto the black. I have to itch. I have to itch. And the last thing I would do would be to take white face paint and this green face paint and mix it together and kind of blend it. Like blend out, hear me? Yeah, but use use the original color to blend out the edges. Like on the around the edges of it, blend it to the, back to that color. This is just a bigger highlight. That? Okay. Yeah, and then here too. You're just trying to blend it in with that green color. Why does Ariel wear seashells? She shells, she shells by the seashore. No, because these shells are too big and these shells are too small. I don't like them. A little booby joke for you. <laughs> I'm so shocked at how good this is turning out, not gonna lie. Ouch. <laughs> my oh, fear. You thought. My fearings. <laughs> There you go. Oh, that is awesome. I did a good job. Thanks for the help. <laughs> Shut your eyes again. Shut your eyes. In your mouth. Oh, I like that a lot. I think I did a good job. Let me get, I'm proud of myself. Let me do some eyeliner. I think I did way better than I was going to. <laughs> no, there you go. I'm going to be honest with myself here. Yeah, hello. Take the victories when you can. I wish I had some Scalera contacts. Yeah, I mean, up close is a little rough. In the camera, it looks really good though. It's, it's a Monet from afar. It's really nice. <laughs> you get close, you're like, that's bad. <laughs> there you go. Nice. Blackest day. The darkest night. Oogie Boogie. She likes the light. I like it. <laughs> you did a good job. On camera, it looks real good. <laughs> Not so much a person, huh? I mean, I think it looks pretty good. You should do a video where you just try and do my makeup normal. Mm -mm. Yeah, let no. me let me know if you want that in the comments below. Every time below. we've done that, you've looked pretty rough. <laughs> it's because of me, though. I mean, like, I'm the, the reason for it. Do you have a newfound appreciation for face paint? I always did. I always thought it was pretty cool. I might try and recreate this look. I'm a fill, but It's on been a while terms. since I dabbled into a fun face makeup. I used to do it all the time. Seems like it'd be hard to do if you were by yourself. Well, thank you guys for joining us. We hope you liked this one as much as you liked the last one. If you guys want to see more of this, you gotta let us know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really appreciate all you guys who come back every week and watch our videos and share them and have a laugh and leave a comment. Subscribe and like and do all that fun stuff. We'll see you guys next week. Bye. Adios. Attempting. <laughs> Create art. Look how white my teeth look. Yeah, I know. Really kind of like contrasts your, your teeth and your eyeballs.